What are you doing to prepare for your future in 2020? Well, so what are you doing to prepare for your success in 2020? Are you studying? Like, learning your scripts and dialogues? Are you practicing? You know, working with other agents? The working out those objections? And not just working out the objections where you're like saying no all the time. But like working the role play out where you have a win because nobody wants to lose all the time. Yes, 95 to 90 percent of the people you contact is going to say no, 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 no. But those no's get you closer to a yes like that. Like it's a book I really like. Um, uh, just say no. Or the power of no. Yeah, that's it. The power of no. And basically what it is, is a story about a, a salesman going through uh, a dream sequence where he realized, hey, I need to keep on hearing no so I can get closer to that yes. And the more people you contact, the more no's you hear, the closer you get to your success. So, don't get discouraged when you're making these calls. Don't be discouraged when you're knocking those doors. Don't be discouraged when you're interacting with people because they're not interested in selling their home now or buying a home now. Just follow up because 80% of your business will come from follow-up. Just reach out to them. Hey, this is William May. I was just calling to wish you and your family happy holidays, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. If you need anything, you can always reach me at 310-800-1556. Take care. Talk to you soon. If they don't answer, you can leave a message. Be scripted. Make sure that when you're talking to them, you, you understand what you need to communicate. So that way you can be very professional. I'm not a very good speaker. I'm not a very good communicator. If I have to think, I'm going, um, the, you know. So that's why I try to think before I speak and I try my best to stay with the script. Because if I stay with the script, I'll be more professional. Because I already know what questions they're going to ask. And when they ask me those questions and I already know how to answer properly, you, you, you'll seem more professional. You will be more professional. So I hope this quick video helps. So in 2020, just study the basics. Just work on the basics. Just like a basketball player does his layups or his dribbles. You have to know the basics so you can succeed in this business. So study your scripts and dialogues. Come into the office when nobody else is here. I'm in the office. <laughs> See, I'm hust hustling. Because if you're, whatever you do today is going to determine, determine how you're going to be living three to six months down the road. So I'm already preparing for my 2020 year in real estate. All right. Well, this is William May, and I hope this helps you. I'll talk to you later. Take care.